The Children's Bible, Genesis 28, Jacob's Flight and Dream Jacob set out from Beersheba and started toward Haran. He came to a certain place and had to stay there all night because the sun had set. Taking one of the stones from the ground, he placed it under his head for a pillow and lay down in that place to sleep. Jacob dreamed, and in his dream he saw a ladder set up on the ground, the top reaching to heaven, and behold, angels of God were going up and down on it. The Lord was standing above the ladder, and he said to Jacob, I am the Lord God of Abraham and the God of Isaac. The land in which you lie I will give to you and to your children. Your children shall be as the, of the dust of the earth, and you will spread abroad to the west and to the east, to the north and to the south. Through you and your children all the families of the earth will be blessed. Behold, I am with you, and I will guard you everywhere you go, and I will bring you back to this place. For I will not leave you until I have done everything I have promised. Then Jacob waked out of his sleep and said, Surely the Lord is in this place, and I did not know it. He was afraid, and said, This is surely the house of God, and this is the gate of heaven. Early in the morning Jacob rose up, took the stone that he had used as a pillow, set it up for a pillar, <coughs> and poured oil upon the top of it. He called the name of that place Bethel. Then Jacob vowed a vow, saying, if God will be with me, and will guard me in the journey I am undertaking, and will give me bread to eat and clothes to wear, if I return again to my father's house in peace, <clears throat> then the Lord will be my God. This stone, which I have set up for a pillar, will be God's house, and of all that you give me, O God, I will give you a tenth.